See, this way I'm getting... Uh... Oh, that's like, what the wow, car says. <laughs> that's what... We went to get the car and David was like, you're from Wyoming? I'm like, Debbie, no. <laughs> no, I was wondering who was, who was at the hotel from Wyoming. Wow. Oh, you're the outfielder. I'm okay. the best outfielder in the league. Are you? Yeah. What? Ben, give me a fly ball. Are you in Little League? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm in majors. Uh huh? Whoa. Now, you look like a pitcher. Just hey Mike. proof that you're working. Yeah, I, I do work once a That's year. That's right. Hey, Mike. Vince, hey Vince, right? Yeah, yeah, it's been a long time. Yeah, Good to see you. you. So you ordered some horses? No, that's a check. Hey, Ginger. Hi there. I don't know. He's got a woman. Have we decided who's in there? I can't see from the reflection. I'm sure, I don't think it's there. He's got blondish, lighter brown hair. Eric's got pitch black. I would, oh, sure. I would love to. You guys look like sisters. Funny how that is. Your name? Is, is Sue uh, coming and she's like coming tonight? Cool. Nadia's here. Because I think they all probably had a different. Yeah. Luckily, I told the boss like very similar. Really? Oh, by the way. Yeah. Everything coming together? Everything's coming together, Mike. Good. I hear there was a little problem with this credit card at the grocery store. No. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't pay his bills. <laughs> Don't start any rumors now. That looks like you're working really hard. Can you do that, Ben? Can you do that again? I don't think I can find it. The hamburger. the hamburger for the spaghetti. Uh, Late start. We had to go, we had to do a lot of shopping today. Uh -huh. So that's what kind of happened. So we're running a little bit, a little bit. What's this? There. The chef isn't uh, <laughs> dipping into the vodka here, is he? Uh, yes, he is. Uh oh. A little bit, but not too much. I'm too busy. Yeah. So. I'm yes, we got people that need to eat. You can't have a <laughs> drinking chef. Like Russ <laughs> says, fuck them. <laughs> we know that. They're just like... <laughs> we knew that before you said <laughs> Now, the idea of some of the shopping that uh, Russ did uh, today, this is just a partial. Uh... Yes. There you go, Sam. <laughs> I just wanted to uh, post 
Uncle Russ and Nadia for opening up their house, and the chef, John, Thank this you. is awesome. I really appreciate it. And it's so great to be together, and uh, we really uh, can't wait to just have this fellowship with everybody for the next few days. Here, here. We had we can a raccoon the other night. Oh yeah. We were scavenging back and forth. I put a couple of pieces of bread there and he took it off right away. And then he was looking for more. So I'm afraid that some of them can get into the garbage bins. Do you have a lot of raccoons around here, or was that? Uh, quite a few. What other wildlife? Oh gosh, yesterday we actually had a show of the wildlife all across this lawn. There were about five elk and uh, about two or three deer. Really? And they were just grazing and enjoying themselves and being nice. very, very nice and healthy. All right, I wonder how they'll be with all the people here. Whether no, they they'll... will not show up. They uh, are all <laughs> too, too noisy. <laughs> So, how's it going here so far? Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, yeah. beautiful. And you've already been here for a week, right? For 10 days. Actually. 10 days. And it's a great place to be for relaxation. Just yeah. sit there and uh, enjoy life and uh, take it slowly. And, uh, so long. Very nice. So do you, you don't usually have this many people here, no, right? No, no, no. Usually there are just two of us. Yeah. Which is, which is nice too. But With an occasional visitor, but not a whole. Yeah, we have occasional. Pretty much every time we come, there is a visitor for a night or two. Right. But then we also have wonderful neighbors. Oh, do you? And we we'll always uh, have at least one dinner with them. So it's, it's a lot of social life. It's surprising. Yeah. <laughs> in, the, in the back of the room, dogs. That's great. Thank you. Besides. <laughs> you don't know how to handle something short, do you? It was amazing. We went in there and it was so cool to see it. I loved it. Wow. Did you get to shuck some too? While you you take a picture of the picture? No, yeah. yeah. You want to see Would you like the video? to get a picture of me taking a picture of yeah. her taking a picture? <laughs> You're out of the game already. Run! Come back! What are are you like in jail or something here? Yeah. How did you get here? DUI. <laughs> DUI? What was your uh <laughs> um, Well she was driving, I was just there. Uh, <laughs> Threw you both in the staff. <laughs> Slimy chicken. Slimy chicken yeah. sounds delicious. It's sort of like that. I'll have a little bit. You have a little bit? Yeah. I don't like this to try yeah. it. Don't go up. Don't go up, Sawyer. So right here. Are you eating it with anything on it, or is yeah, everybody just having them? Look, like no one ate that. They're not. Okay, salty. Yeah. 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 Yeah, well, I mean, only. Not my fire, not my fire. <laughs> What's you oh, cooking here? Hi there. How's it going so far? Good, Mike. We're having a great time. What are you about to eat? Uh, salmon. Very good garlic salmon barbecued by your wonderful brother. My wonderful brother? I don't know. Oh. Oh. And your cousin, Eric. And uh, what are you uh, drinking there? A little bit of a red wine from Argentina. Ooh, that's that's quite good. delicious. Yes, I just made 14 root beer floats for the kids. That looks like somebody's having root beer floats, it looks like. Is that right? No, 
Yeah, they're good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, so this one's here. Oh, yeah. And all of a sudden you run out, and then you have to order more. Yeah. And it's yeah. like, it's like why don't they send yeah. them to another family? Yeah. You could be screwing this up and what's the gimmick or not? Yeah, well, you haven't eaten yet. Are you using all proper health uh, practices here? Uh, Totally no, sanitary. No, I don't have any because I don't have any because I don't have any because I don't have I don't I don't I am I Pick. And in 1966, I married into the family. I married Jim Pick. Um, so the, for you younger people who don't know the family history and background and who's, how, who's connected to who, um, the grandparents, uh, Clinton Pick and Russell Pick, had um, four children. But Clint Pick had had a prior marriage after he uh, completed his service in World War I. He married Edna, and they had um, Clint Jr. And then that marriage dissolved, and Clint married Russell Robinson, who is the mother of uh, Russ, Virginia, Nancy, and Jim. Each of them had, uh, except for Jim, it, er, the senior ones, uh, Clint Jr., and the four eldest pet children each had four children. So when I married into the family, I, an only child, with no brothers and sisters, no nieces and nephews, and instantly got 15 nieces and nephews. And then, then uh, Kristen was born, so I had 16. <laughs> and so everybody here who is a child or a spouse of you know, women, those people is connected, and that's the familial connection. Mommy, and, um, my children are at this table. This is Adam, who I guess everybody knows, and <laughs> my grandson Sebastian in August, and my daughter Jennifer, who's married to Mike McCarthy, and her three boys, who I think you've met. Um, one who's rolling really balls around over there, Will, and Sammy's here somewhere, and the youngest member of this entire pet clan, little Tim, who's chewing on his mother's jacket right now. <laughs> so has been just a marvelous road for me, You're coming from a family with no brothers and sisters, to have this wonderful extended family in which I've always felt really supported. And um, this is coming into this family, everyone is always so generous and, and warm and loving. And I hope those characteristics extend on into your families and your lives because it's really wonderful for families to feel that support. That's a tough act to follow. Everyone knows, <laughs> Everyone knows but you. She kept it too short, so I'm going to kind of, I have a lot more to say. So, I'm Adam Peck. She actually just did everything to explain it. She is my mother. My father is Jim Peck. Jim Peck is the brother of Russ. And I'm delighted to be here with all of you. <laughs> all right. And I'm Jennifer Peck, so I'm Jim Peck, Jim Peck's daughter, and um, and my mom too. <laughs> um, and he can't be here today with us, and um, so we miss him, and we wish he could be. Um, my husband is Mike, who's over here in the red. Mike grew up in New York on Long Island, and he um, moved out to Oregon after college, and we met years after that. But we got married six years ago, and we've had three little boys since then, so we're raising a baby family. Um, I'm David Peck. I'm the son of Russ Peck and Sue Peck. And uh, I grew up with a lot of cousins here that I haven't seen for 40 years. I'm 52. I have two boys, Andrew and Soar, and my lovely wife Anne here. Um, and uh, we're uh, just lucky to have this beautiful property to have all you guys come and join our uh Clan, you might say. And the nice house that you built. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>
but I did spend a lot of time in this property. I have a lot of uh, sentimental ties here. Uh, I had a lot of emotional things happen at this property, so this is uh, a spiritual place for me, which I don't even say spiritual very often. And so all you guys here is a really great uh, connection for me to get all the uh, family back tied together and, uh, you know, seeing who who's done uh, different things and and powerful things in life and I just, uh, hope all of you guys uh, enjoy the place and I appreciate Nadia and Dad for putting this on and uh, John for cooking so well. Um, my, I have three sisters, I have no brothers, three sisters. My sister Chris here, she's our youngest. Um, my sister Kim and Melanie right here uh, and I'm just proud to be here. Hey, I'm Deborah Jones Margison, and I am the daughter of Daryl and Virginia Jones. Virginia was the oldest of Clinton Russ's four children, and my siblings Cliff and Sue are both here. I have another brother who wasn't able to be here, Steve, and um, my husband Eric will be here tomorrow. For those of you that are still here, we'll get a chance to meet him, and I have two children, Adam and Emma who also were not able to be here. I'll get me up to you. Next table over there. Oh, I can see it. Who are you? I like your style. I thought I could get out of this with a bathroom. <laughs> Just joking. Um, well, I'm Galena Graham, and uh, this lady, oh, Robinson, which that's somewhere in the line of the family, so that's that. And uh, this is my mom, Melanie, over here in the pink, and uh, yep, yeah, that's me. <laughs> August James Peck and I'm seven. Sisters are Lucinda and Emma. She's somewhere. And my my mom is uh, Samantha over there and Eric. Benjamin Louise Toys, aka Benjamin Louise Peck Toys, aka Benjamin <laughs> Louise Toys. <laughs> and my mom is Kristen Toys, Sophia Rose Toys, and um, Louise Toys. And those are all your moms. <laughs> <laughs> Louise Toys is my dad. Sophia Toys is my sister. And <laughs> Everybody's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you say that is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm, I'm Sawyer Stewart Peck, and my brother is Andrew Peck, and my dad is Dave Peck, and my mom is Simone Peck, and Anne Peck, Mom Peck. Mom Peck. Yeah. Good job. Nice. Oh. Um, I'm Andrew David Peck, I'm 11, and my dad is David Peck, and my mom is Ann Peck, and um, my brother is Tori Peck, and... <gasps> Go number one! Bro! <laughs> 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 my name is Sophia Rose Torres, and my mom is Kristen Tor Torres, and my dad is Luis Torres, and my brother is Ben Torres. Yeah. My name is Lucinda Lee Mooney. 
That was Lucinda. I'm seven and I'm Lucinda. I am Sebastian Sashay Peck. Um, my brother's right there. August. Uh, my dad's here. Adam's. Mom's right there. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Megan Harder, and I'm really related to any of you, but I'm Chris's stepdaughter. And Tom's my stepbrother. Next, we're glad you came. Thank you. That table. Okay, I'm the oldest cousin, or, or oldest of the Peck clan in terms of uh, Peck, uh, Clint Peck Sr. I am the oldest uh, grandson. Oldest grandchild. <laughs> and that makes me feel old. Yeah, he looks, he looks old. <laughs> but I'm still, I'm still able to walk. I'm still able to probably outlast uh, all of you. <laughs> and, and I'm still working. This is my son Chris. This is my wife Lucy. My daughter Liz. My granddaughter Melissa. And my... Uh, Grandson is uh, over there, I guess, is he? Uh, Michael Jr. and my uh, son-in-law Michael's here as well, as as well as two of uh, of, uh, of two family friends. Two family friends. <laughs> and, uh, and a couple my, of hitchhikers. Uh, my brother Mike is the videographer here, uh, and my brother uh, uh, Mike uh, John is uh, the cook. Across the chef. Harry calls me. He Harry calls me a week ago. Can you help me? Can you help me? I need help. <laughs> no, it wasn't to you. It was to your son. <laughs> <laughs> and our and our uh, brother Will is back uh, taking care of our dog in Aptos. <laughs> so uh, other than that, thank you. Uh, we, we're, we live in San Jose, California, and uh, we uh, came up here to visit and have some good times. It's good to see everybody. All right. Susan and Debbie. Uh, Steve, my older brother, was unable to come. I have my lovely wife, Kathy, here. We live the better in, half. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we live in Bellevue, Washington. Um, we have two daughters, Jennifer and Haley, uh, 19 and 17, respectively. And this is a very special time. Uh, I've seen a lot of folks for the first time and um, well over 30 years. So, thank you. And, and you got introduced. I mean, I'm introduced, so nothing needed said. Hi. How about the baby introduces? <laughs> <laughs> I like to hear what he has to say. Yeah. Okay, I'm Vince Vauter. I am married to Kim, who's Russ's daughter. My daughters are Annika and Natalie. And I have a very special connection to this place. I traveled here before this house was built and helped watch Dave build it. And it's this an amazing property that has a spiritual connection for everybody. So it's really nice to be here with all these people. People I've never met before, people I've known for almost my, my entire life. And I really appreciate uh, um, Nadia and Russ putting this on. It means a lot to me. Very nice. Yay! Oh, heavens, I'm here. Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Annika, and I'm the daughter of Vince and Kim Peck. And I'm 21 in the college. And my sister is Natalie right there. And yes. <laughs> Thank you. 
Pat Fodder, and it's great to be here with everybody. I'm the daughter of a, a Russ and Sue. You probably already figured that out. And married events have two daughters. And um, I just love coming here, just seeing the natural beauty and having everybody just be able to enjoy it all together is really special. So thank you. Hello, I'm Jonathan Peck. I didn't have anything prepared at all, but you know what? I've been cooking a little bit here and there, so that's why I'm a little bit crazy in the head right now. So anyway, um, but you know what? It was interesting because I was reading this letter from my grandfather today. And he fought World War One in uh, France, 1918, 1919, because uh, the Americans were engaged in the war in 1917 to 1919. And I was like, it's really fascinating. I was in Europe in the early 70s, and uh, he wrote me this letter. And then, um, I'll show you guys the letter. I have it here. And then seeing my father fight in World War Two, and he fought in the South Pacific, so was, there's a lot of history there. But we have to remember the history of our families, and it's important. So anyway, I love you guys. Take it easy. <laughs> Um, I am Kristen Peck Torres, and I'm married to Luis Torres over there. Thank you. And, uh, <laughs> Go Giants! <laughs> I'm the um, youngest daughter of um, Sue and Russ Peck, and um, I grew up with many of, many of my cousins, knowing them and visiting them when I was little. Um, but I haven't seen you for a while, and as an adult, and it's so fun to introduce my kids, um, Ben and Sophia, thank you, thank you. to their cousins. And I think they're just amazed that all these people are sitting around eating dinner, and everybody's related to each other. And they're like, "Wow, it's it's pretty remarkable." And this is a really special place to be together. And thank you all for making the effort to come. It's a busy world, and thank you. All right. I'm Melanie uh, Graham, Peck Graham. So, Dad is my dad. <laughs> <laughs> Suzanne is my mom. <laughs> I was kind of the, the emailer, the instigator, the coordinator of you guys. So, nice hopefully, Melanie. I did. Yeah. One thing that I did learn is that even though this uh, pet clan did begin, at least with our generations, in California, a lot of us are in the Pacific Northwest, you guys, so we really should do this more often, I think. Okay. Maybe even here, somewhere else, but I, I don't think we should let this slip through. Um, so maybe I'll be bothering you again in the near future. So thank you all. Galena's my daughter. I have a son named Finn. He's 23. I uh, couldn't be here because he's working. But um, hopefully we'll see you all sooner than uh, later. All right, thank you. Yes. Natalie. Oh, Natalie. <laughs> Hi, uh, my name is Natalie Vodder, and this is my dad, Vince Vodder, and my mom, Kim Peck Vodder, and my sister, Annika. And I'm 18, and it's really nice to meet you all. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Manya Sache and I'm married to Adam Peck and Sebastian Peck and August Peck are my children. So my name, my name is uh, Luis Torres, I'm married to Kristen Torres, as you know, and I have two kids, Sophia and Ben, and Ross is my favorite father-in-law. <laughs> um, Do you have another? I don't, but that's... <laughs> <laughs> but he's so special, by the way. <laughs> Uh, I missed that. Uh, no, I miss that? Uh, yes. um, anyway, so it, I, I, am, I am super excited to have my kids learn about their family roots and learn about their cousins and second cousins and what their family is about. And thank you for doing that. 
Great. Right. <laughs> and ex-wife of Russ, and I'm I'm proud to be here and reconnect with all of you kids that I saw when you were young, and it's it's a pleasure and a joy to see this reunion. And thank you, Russ, for creating it. Yeah. All right, Russ. Yeah. <laughs> Barbecue King tonight. <laughs> They're all telling you. They don't need to know. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, I am Tom Deskin, and it would have been better if you did it first, but then I could have gone. Just said, I am. Chris's son, um, and that's my cuz right there, which is, you know, well, kind of puts everything. <laughs> well, I'm gonna let her do the history part of it, and yeah. <laughs> I am Chris Harder, um, Nancy Moni's daughter, and um, like he said, this is my cuz. He's got a lot of those. I'm not your cousin. <laughs> this is my son, Tom, and my stepdaughter, Megan, over there, who introduced herself, because you guys didn't get that. Um, my daughter Adriana wasn't able to be here, but and my wonderful husband Phil, um, who I married in 2009, and I am living in Washington State, and I, like all you guys, am just amazed at this opportunity to get together with all my cousins and reconnect with um, uh, Karen and Sue, and I'm just so blessed to be part of a family and, and so thankful that you and your wonderful wife would put this on for all of us. And, all the work that everybody's going to, so thank you. Nice. Hi, I'm Sue Bashirs, Sue Jones Bashirs. I'm Cliff's sister and Debbie's sister. Um, I live in Wellsville, Missouri, and married a sailor 40 years ago next year, and moved to Missouri and have not been back a lot since. Um, we have three children, Ann, Jess, and Kim. And let's see what else I want to tell you. I'm passing around the sheet and I'm asking you all to sign it with your names and contact information. So, so, and I promise if you'll do that, I'll type it up and send it to all of you. Um, also, I just want to respond to Chris. You may be the oldest grandchild, but as Grandpa um, Peck said to me, I am the number one granddaughter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Samantha Moni, wife to Eric Moni, mother to three awesome kids. That's right. I am Brister to Chris Hart. That's right. <laughs> Brister. And um, Brendan. Melanie has started a guest book, and we would like everybody to sign it. That's the contact sheet. Chris, I I there's a guest book oh. there that's more formal, it's so that we'll stay here for rest and nod you to. Oh, and you can put your personal little comments in there. Oh, so, if you would fill that out too. It'd be awesome. All right, nice. Right here? Yeah. Come on, Eric. Star Wars. Everybody. Star Wars. I am Eric Moni, son of Nancy Moni, the third peck child of Clinton and Russell. Correct. And I'm married to Samantha and my uh, daughter Emma and son Jesse and daughter Lucinda are here and um, 
I'm just overwhelmed with how surreal this experience is, and I absolutely love it. It's like time has stopped, mm -hmm. and I just love the one-on-one -on -one conversations that I've had with all of you, and uh, love y'all dearly, and I think it's just an amazing experience. Uh, thanks to John for chefing it up for us, and uh, it's been a pleasure to, to help uh, be part of this, man. It's an uh, incredible property, and I can't believe you put this together. It's so cool. Don't undercook the salmon next time, okay? <laughs> 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 Just kidding, I, have, I have one other acknowledgement, the unsung hero here. There's two Who's uh, of recording all this? Uh, oh, oh my, I was going to get out of it because I'm oh, on this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Turn that camera around. Come on, Mike, you have to say something. Come on, Mike. Oh, let's see. Uh, Come on, Mike. <laughs> I'm Mike, Pe uh, Mike Peck, uh, son of Clinton Peck. Hi uh, there. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> talking to yourself. Yeah, kind of, God, I'm good looking. Uh, and, uh, I, uh, yeah, I uh, want to thank Russ and Nadia for having all of us and for seeing all of you. It's been great. Uh, I live in Ben Lomond, California, which is a little town that uh, our uh, grandfather and his family was the first town they lived in. It's a little tiny town when they first came up from Southern California to Northern California in 1910, I believe they lived there. And by coincidence, that's where I live. So. Wow. Yeah. Really? Yeah. What else, Mike? Yes. Oh, that's enough. That's enough. Okay. Is your arm getting tired yet? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's his, his mouth. <laughs> I, was just, I was enjoying looking at myself. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Russ? Oh. I'm Ann Peck, married to David Peck, my son Sawyer Peck and Andrew Peck. And it's a pleasure to be here, and it's been so wonderful seeing all the little kids and the college kids have fun and reconnect and, and meeting uh, my husband's cousins for the first time. It's, it's been a great pleasure. Wait, hold Daniel on, hold Dasha on. Over there. Daniel He's Dasha. talking, it's oh, his yeah. turn. No, no, it's not, he's last. Oh, by the way. Yeah, you too. Yeah, well, you too. Well, okay. well, definitely, we'll be up and go. I'm uh, Maddie Peck, I'm the lady of the house. Uh, uh, Russ and I got married in uh, 1993, so this April, we celebrated our 20th wedding anniversary. Wow. I, uh, you know, I always said that this house is not used enough because I love the place, I, I, I love the property, the house has such a great ambience. And most of the time, uh, it's just the two of us. And unfortunately, because we uh, have other uh, engagements in the Bay Area, we cannot come here as uh, often as uh, it should be. Uh, and I'm so happy that finally the house is used to its full capacity. <laughs> so that's probably the way that we need to start treating it. It's a, you know, a wonderful place to share with uh, everyone. Uh, so welcome and uh, We've all moved in. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're not leaving. No, 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 most of the time we are not here. And this will get, Perfect. Keep the property probably more than yeah. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> no problem at all. Uh, so if you have any questions, like uh, you know, whatever technicalities, maintenance comes up, please let me know. I'll try to, to help. I can work promise to resolve every single problem that arise, but uh, certainly most of them can be. Um, I'm not going to torture you with my full Russian name, which is very long, and uh, uh, I go by Nadia Perk, but uh, sometimes uh, you hear or you see it's uh, like Nadezhda Alexandrovna Mizinova Perk. It's still me. <laughs> much longer name. Um, I have one daughter, Dasha, who is right here. I know that. She's a teacher. 
Yes. So she has a tendency yes. to speak for everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> I, yes, I'm used to speaking, so just rest, kind of relax. <laughs> I'm on the stage five hours a day, so <laughs> I'm used to that. And these two active grandkids uh, are mine. <laughs> so uh, wonderful to have. Uh, all of you here, and uh, thank you for, very much for making the special plans to come over here. Because, you know, it's, it's a long way, it's in the boondocks, but that's beautiful too. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Come on, Dasha. Well, everybody Get up. Me. My mom already introduced me. No, no, you're not getting out of it that easily. Hey, I'm Dasha, I'm Nadia's daughter. Everybody knows here, here are my two kids, Hello. my little monster. Yeah, you, you're not the kid then. It's, uh, it's the little one, the one in the orange, Alexander. And um, um, yeah, I live in the Bay Area with my husband. Uh, unfortunately, he couldn't make it. So that's about it. Yes, and your husband is French, so we have a very international <laughs> family. So I'm, I'm very glad to be here, I'm glad to be part of this family. And thank you. Uh, my, my name is Irving Schwartz. <laughs> And I was, I was down on Highway 101 Hitchcock. <laughs> and he said, get your ass up. I'll put the text place. Here I am. I told him not to pick you up. <laughs> it's awfully nice to have you here. You know who I am, I guess. Um, David built the house in 19, what, 1991? Yes, in 91. 91. And uh, we've enjoyed it very much, and I, I, from all appearances, you are enjoying it also. And it pleases uh, me and, and my wife Nadia very much to have you here. Thank you for coming. It's been a wonderful uh, experience for me, and I hope for you also. Thank you. Oh, Say hi to Jim. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Hi, Jim. Yeah. Yeah. We love you, Jim. Yeah. Hey, could, could I make a quick statement too? I appreciate you saying that from from Jim. And I wanted to say I just came from seeing my dad. I wanted y'all to know that Dad expressed very clearly that he wished he could see all of you kids and how you're doing and want y'all to know that he was saying hi to you and he would love if any of you ever wanted to come by and see him i mean he's a couple miles south of portland but he's got a beautiful place got a place for you to stay he, he would be glad for you to come by so anyways daryl says hi Hi Daryl! Hi Daryl! Hi Daryl! Hi Daryl! We're all going to there. Hey, my mom's like, I ran too long. Um, hurting cats. Yeah, exactly. Hey, Chris, did Dave go up top? But it's kind of short. We think it. We think it. Okay. Okay, now you can start acting like yourselves weird as a video. Okay. Now everybody act real serious for a minute. You enjoying it, John? Mike, your fly is down. Okay, everybody wave. Okay, uh, all right. Yeah, 
happy for well, yeah, what's the date today? Thank you. Yeah, do the wave. Wait, you're doing the wave. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Super tough hands to the scalding hot water because uh, those people, look at that, it's scalding hot. But I, you're like used to it, hands. right? Yeah. Tough, tough hands. All right. Okay. That's my secret. Yeah. No. No, get it. No, don't get it. He doesn't want it. He can't get it. <laughs> That's dark lines look pretty easy. Yeah. Popped right up. I don't know if popped, popped. right up, but that wouldn't be <laughs> more sort of staggered. Mom, like, she was doing the dishes, I'm watching. Saw him just, boop, just disappeared, just ran out there. And thought for sure he was massive. How, how far was that, that fall? Oh, are you serious? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a lolly. That's, that was, this was two or three feet. No, it was a big, it was a, it's a big, that was the golden age hey. of, of Cousin Q. Hey, hey, Adam, you want to know the ultimate insult, though? The golden when, age. When my, when, my son, when my husband's grandmother saw our son after he was born, Adam, he turned, she turned to Eric's mother. This is her daughter, who is Adam's grandmother. She turns to her and says, well, you sure better looking than Eric was, isn't he? That didn't sit well with Eric's mother. It's all good. But the truth kids. was, he oh, was actually. a little better looking. Yeah, he's he's a, kid. Kid. He's a lot smarter than the kids. That says a lot. Well, are you smarter than a fifth grader? <laughs> not really. <laughs> well, I'm certainly not. <laughs> Maybe a second grader? <laughs> yeah. Maybe a second grader. Dave might get a second grader, I could probably get a third grader. <laughs> The bigger ones are spruce. Okay. The weapons put it says on the prison. Don't I see you have quite a bigger stick. Time to call for the bigger stick. Then the fall in fire. I had fire by myself and my parents. The kids all were there at our house for Thanksgiving. And it's the first and only time we've had like a big So she's pretty family. adept with this. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh Suzanne. Well, Everything was looking good. <laughs> <laughs> That's when they're good when they're burned. Oh, oh. Oh. I don't know, Sue. She has her own style. <laughs> don't just, don't try to do any fire walking, though. Yeah. See how long I can burn this book. All right, let's see if the chef knows how to roast a marshmallow. Oh, <laughs> no. He's a cook, Debbie. <laughs> so you got the best stick in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Suzanne, don't mess around with the fire. Look at this, he's got a shield going yeah. on right now. Oh, no. <laughs> Getting the right angle and stuff. Oh, I had a 
oven and and I have to put it in that oven and I have to put it in well, that's easy for us. Hey, well, we'll see. Uh, I think doing pretty well. <laughs> Is that your best ever? No. Oh, yeah. no, not by a long way. But it's a good, it's a good, good, uh, good job. Hey, Russ, can you push the marshmallow down a little bit? <laughs> I like that. No. Are the kids playing baseball? We had the half like that. Pretty good. John, you know, I think that's the best thing you've cooked in the last two days. Oh. That's great. Oh. 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 <laughs> hey, Mike, I wanted to show you this. Oh, oh, look, look at this. Looks like an ice cream cone now. I don't see one on the end of that one. <laughs> Uh-oh. They're in the fire. <laughs> Look at my marshmallow. I think it's going to drip all the way down to the end of the stick. <laughs> yeah, that's where it would be. I thought Long, View Long Beach was back. Oh, look over there. I mean, like. Oh, there's one. There's, you can see him a little better here. Okay. I think. A little better is. Little, little. Pretty far away. <laughs> yeah. If I zoom all the way in, I can see them. Yeah. Here's where you can. They're over there and down here. Just be careful. <laughs> 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 What you eating? Berries? Grapes? Uh, it's hard for him to talk with a mouthful. Yeah. <laughs> you know, five or six at a time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he likes to eat about five or six at a time. He's kind of supplementing breakfast. Ah. Uh, breakfast was very good. Yeah. Nice. Inside the park error home run. Grand slam. Strike. Oh, lucky hat now. <laughs> Grand slam, Ben. Come on.
She did not have a fun ride, you know why? Because she had to sit next to me. The whole time she's going like, Ew, it's smelly back here next to this man. Cape of disappointment? Something like that, I believe. <laughs> I'm not disappointed Hopefully, yet. We're not going to be disappointed. <laughs> so far, there's no disappointment. It is, I expect we're going to walk over there, and all of a sudden, it's going to be like tar or something. Adam kept saying, "Am I wrong? Am I wrong?" Let's see uh, if I can get under there. Then I'll get you. <laughs> So, oh, you got your lens cap on. You can't take my picture. Now I can. Uh oh. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in. Oh, yeah. What do you say to Andrew? Here, Mister. For that reason, I wouldn't take it. I'm sure not. They're kind of small. Oh, we're California. We are great trees. Oh, California. That was one thing we never once saw. What's up, Stephen? You want to hold what? Overall, you're saying that you're saying that that's symbolic. Yeah, the, the really the interesting part was that the new one. He's in the blue. He's off himself. He's seen outside. How long has this grass been here, Cliff? Oh, about since the day I was born. Prehistoric time? Yes. Yeah. And this is all uh, Lewis and Clark's diary, is it? Yes, that's my understanding. That's what it seems like. It's pretty. It's almost like having a paved yellow brick road. <laughs> exactly. So you could be the first person to transplant one of these suckers. And uh, uh, tell me, what do you call it again? Well, with my kids, I call this some scream. <laughs> some scream. That's great. That's a little commercial you just did for some scream. <laughs> You want to hear my Scooby Doo impersonation? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <laughs> yeah. Over here! <laughs> <I'm>, <laughs> very good. I'm e easily amused, but I do find that very good. <laughs> it's been a while since I've ever seen What was that? Wait a second. Give some back. of that, huh? Yeah, let's hear it. <laughs> It's not so it's a little low. And if you want to come, you have to ask him yeah. up. Yeah. I already did. You did? What'd you say? Yes. Got it? Step right here. Have a nice surf. Okay. Surfing Suzanne. That's right. Yeah, see, we made it. Victory. Wait, did we? Is that the lookout? Oh, oh, I have to get a shot of everybody. Is that where they're walking over, or are they heading down? I don't think it's that far, but maybe. So where are we now, Dave? What's off there? Is that the actual ocean, right? Disappointed. Yeah, that's the ocean here. This is the uh, mouth of the Columbian right here. That's just a rock to, uh, behind it, I'm sure there's, uh, you know, for boats, that's just a protective 
and so the, the, there's not a lot of sand eddies that come, you know? Yeah. Keeps the water deep. And that's the lighthouse way off there. Yeah. yeah. And this is where the Lewis and Clark Trail ends, somewhere down there, right? Right here. This Keep is where they settled. For quite some... And they actually settled here for a little while. Yeah, huh? for a little while. Yeah. I think they got rained out, though. <laughs> Just long enough to kill a few Indians and get rained out. Pretty much probably all the poor Indians. You still see the bald eagle? Yeah. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, okay, there it is. We actually saw two uh, kind of mating on the way out. They came out... They made while they're flying? Yeah, flying. Are you sure? Yeah, sure. <laughs> 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 sure? <laughs> Natalie, Natalie, she's always questioned. Oh, I just think Aww. that's a little unusual. You're Look at this, right down there. Look at how beautiful that is. Oh, oh you're beautiful. Oh, you're beautiful. Yeah. And they don't get that white head until they're seven or something. Yes. Melanie is an expert. Uh, if you have any bald really? eagles, yes, she will. I, I, I'm oh, becoming wow. a bird fan. I'm going to be a fanatic. I'm going to start taking classes. And... This is where the defense area for World War II when they thought Japanese could be invading. So they had guns and lookouts all posted at this coast. So if we go down, you can actually see in those rooms and things. Wow. Can we go down? Yeah. That's, That's a real picture. picture. Where are the it's so real. Where? But where's like, the look, window? You see these little barrack things? Somewhere around here, I'm sure. Oh, it's right there. And you can look, go look, inside, look. you guys. That's yeah, the you're right. And that's, you're right. New, that's uh, the that's four wait, miles what, away. That's what? Broke. Sort of yeah, what? So yeah. four miles away, there's a lighthouse, and this gun right here broke the glass. Because it was so loud. The, the concussion. That's insane. Wait, why was it removed? Oh. Oh. Um. They didn't need anymore. Wait, this yeah. was the Big Betsy right here? They didn't want. People like you, you know, this one, firing yeah. it. They had a whole team here, like <laughs> a hospital, a school, a library. What, here? Yeah, see? Uh, oh, just someone's like right at the barrel. I'm gonna kill myself. I feel like my head's in it. <laughs> So let's go in this oh, this room right here. Oh, this was started in 1863. Yeah. Oh, wow. I wonder why they would have built it back then. Yeah, it that's seem odd. Like they have. I don't know if they were, but I could be wrong. They like, want to be in here. Oh, okay. You fit. Would you guys like to move in here? Make these your beds permanently? <laughs> I would still love to have you guys in here. Yeah, we'll have some fun. 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 Yeah, we'll have I think Sawyer's too tall to fit. Are you caught her? Oh, I just remember one of those like young soldiers. Uh, uh, like, this, this guy with this guy was really tall, just like bang. Yeah, move, kid. You're the terrible police. Corn rolls. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that's funny. 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 Yeah, that's Found all the kids. They're really different. Woo! Probably in Japan, because yeah. Japan buys at the top, top dollar. And here, they send all the best wood to Japan. So that's going to be a mm -hmm. boat full of lumber yep. in a little bit. On Probably its way to framing, Japan. Framing lumber. Hemp wow. fur. This is the fortified wall. I'm very impressed with this. This is the grand looking monument. To the permanence of man's institutions. This will stand until the end of time. You can come back here, kids. We are high tide. Fifty yeah, which years is from now, you will find this standing here. Bigger, yeah. stronger than ever. Be there and we come back every day, and it's gone. No, no, you will need to be here for all time. Why? Why? Because it's just we built it so strong, solid. 
What have you got there? What is that? <laughs> You've got something that is very... Something either from the earth or from the sea. We're not sure. It could be kelp, it could be something else. It's very impressive, whatever it is. I think it would make some nice jewelry. Like a necklace or something. Yeah. Or a bracelet. Oh, now that's cute. You guys are cute. Yeah, I know. Stay there for a second. Let me get all the shots in now, Cousins. <laughs> you guys, let's do another group picture. That's on that right. Log. Get people along the log yeah, let's do uh, and around the castle. On the log. Sam, your mom was telling me how much you're like my daughter Anne. Like, who, who majored in physics at college and minored in English? Oh, yeah. It's going to make us all laugh. No, having fun. Come on, Mel, Come on, Go, Sam, go. Okay, oh. Sam, go there and get the first Go get him, Sam, you're the first one. Get him, you're the first up. Oh, oh you were right. He just said, I'm first. Oh, wait, hold on, back on. Here it is, final one. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Get set. Go. Okay. That tunnel survived. All the strength is right built. Yeah. Looks like my reinforced walls weren't that helpful. I have one. Yo, yo. Oh, there's still some. So. So what do you got here, John? What do you we have? Some uh, baby back ribs. Oh. Uh, we're gonna have. Does that mean it's like a baby cow or something, or what? No, they're pork. Oh, so baby it's like pig. A small pig, yeah. Oh, baby back ribs. Baby back ribs. They're one and three quarters pounds. So, so you killed a little tiny baby pig for this? No, you know? we did not. It's a oh. sort of a medium-sized pig. Oh. Okay. They smell good, huh? Mmm. <laughs> I don't know. I think the commissioner was oh, probably good, more good. It was just a uh, nervous about it. But anyway, he, he had a real nice humorous person that very, uh, anyway, I got my license. <laughs> I mean, I so I've been driving ever since. But, uh, I, drove, uh, I drove his car. It didn't have, uh, what is it? Uh, no, so. Stick chip. A manual transmission. Manual, that's yeah. right. And so I have to keep doing that. <laughs> but anyway, and then the road wasn't that straight either. It was curvy like this. And you have logging trucks and trucks and stuff going around. And I'm not used to anything like that. And they're all going fast because in the city you only drive a lot. What, 25? That was really like going around the curve. Okay, awesome. Just like, you <laughs> know. You can roll your corn in the uh, butter there if you guys like. Yeah. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Sorry. Hey, you guys. Hey, David. Make sure they don't go through. Oh, God. Oh, God.
Yeah, you're going to yes, pick up here. Oh, okay. I don't yeah. know. But at 6 o'clock, there's oh, not going to be too many people people away. Probably I me. Will. Are you going I to will. circles there? I am. I'm always awake early. <laughs> <laughs> I started laughing. There you go, sir. Oh, one small for you. One small for one million. I was like, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I was like, I love it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How many are you going to do? The arrival back. Where's Dad? Oh, that's you. Oh, the fire! <laughs> Did that go? Oh, the fire's going on. Toilet in the house. Okay, who's responsible? All right, thank you, Karen. Who clogged the toilet? I think collectively we did. <laughs> That's why Dad had the porta potty. I'm proud to I've been that using the outdoor the ones. Man, like yes. I have my toilet paper in the basket. Well, we thought there was going to be really, really I'd big really ones. Like yeah. Except they actually turn into the um, like really sparkling good. ones, but they're really fun. How would you describe the biggest ones? What kind of noises were they? Um, they made like, like there's like screaming type voice. Uh, with the fireworks. Oh, nice. So is it good enough? until next year. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I used to be really good at it. I to dress up every day. I haven't been working from home. I was like, I don't know where it is. I'm going to take three hours to go each way and get back. That's six hours of stuff that I can be doing. So I I sit at home and I was like, well, I'm not shaving. And I just let it grow, and I was like, well, let's see how far I can go with it. I like that. Thank you. 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 Yeah. I'm sure everybody can hear it in my voice. Oh yeah, I can now. Good morning, sunshine. Good morning. How are you? Pretty good. Wow. What story are you reading? Yeah. Oh, Winnie the Pooh. And that doesn't look like a regular book. What kind of book is that? An iPod. I did. No, she's not going to try to make it. I mean, she didn't want to take the extra extra day, and then she thought she needed to work Friday, but then she ended up having Friday off. So, so, but by that time, like, the price is going to be up tickets went off. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can break it a lot down at the house, too. Well, that's the thing. She's like, oh, it's going to take advantage of that. Yeah, he can just chip away at it. Yeah, he's turning to do that. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's you right. know me. He installed the electrical outlets. Oh, no, do it. Oh, yeah. I mean, now, Ready? you're going to okay. bend your knees. And you're hot right here. Fire. Whoa. Are you? Are you? Are you a kangaroo? Yeah. <laughs> when we came up here on vacation, as a family, yeah. with the pecs? Yeah. Yes, with I the did. gym pecs. Before there was any. And, uh, and we rented a place up here. Oh. And the, right near. On Here. this on this strip somewhere. Oh. And we would we went out and we we 
dug for oysters. Oh. We, and clams. We, um, so you can find oysters and clams here most likely now. And we had a lot of fun. And the kids were little. Uh -huh. and Jim and Karen's kids were little. We made oysters. We, we ate clam chowder and we, we packaged oysters in the ice cream containers, the big, big ones that we would buy for all the kids. Right. And froze them in the freezer and oh. took them back all frozen. And then New Year's Eve, we made oyster stew. From the oh, nice. It was very funny. Yes. Uh, and the one guy says, oh, no, don't pay us now. You can pay us when you leave. And we're like, what are you talking about? Well, we'll wait here and, and we'll take you back. Or, no, no, we're not sure even, you know, how long we'll be or which direction. And, yeah, no, he, they wanted our business. Well, finally we convinced them that we would pay them and we left. And then it wasn't long. And, and, and we're walking down the street and Ann looks and it's like, there they are. And, and, so, and so we kept turning the corners and, the, and, well, and I start to laugh and he's aggravated with me and then for each she goes over and she's like, that's all, that's all, you have no right to be doing this, this is their, and oh, she's scolding them and, and so then we go around the next corner and there they are like this and, and of course I, I'm laughing and then it's like Anne's mad at me. <laughs> She's like, Mom, you're just encouraging them. <laughs> 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 I've been dreaming about going to San Fran for a Seahawks game. Oh, that would be good. Be cool to. How far are you from San Francisco? Oh, an hour. Oh my God! Yeah, we're just yeah. an hour away. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I thought, gee, well, if they're ten minutes ahead, I'm not gonna catch up anyway. So. <laughs> nice strollers. God, you look great. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> Perfect timing. I needed to get some hikers. <laughs> You're going to roll down the hill? Whoa. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> I noticed you're not stopping. Whoa, he's a really good roller. <laughs> Whoa, don't hit the tree. <laughs> you gonna roll? Okay. You can roll, but don't rock. Whoa. Whoa! Wow, she's really good. It's great because of her hair, too. It makes it look really neat. <laughs> How's Andrew doing now? Anybody know? Yeah. Yeah. I hope he gets better. That's a nice thing. Andrew, I warned you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? What, what, what do you think caused Andrew to get sick? I don't know. I think he ate too much stuff last night because he... Five marshmallows, too much spaghetti, and what was it else? I don't know. Maybe some drinks? Well, how about you guys? What were you eating? I... Did you eat any marshmallows? I ate one. Oh, just one? Mm -hmm. I ate one. I fell asleep Just fine. one. Okay. And no stomach aches? Okay. So maybe it was the extra marshmallows. Hmm. So, um, now what's your name? Lucinda. Lucinda. Now tell me how you're related to everybody here. Who's your parents? Eric and Samantha. Eric and Samantha. So you guys are second cousins, right? Yeah. Your name is? Sophia. And Sophia. my mom and dad are Chris and Luis. My mom, she, um, her dad is Russell. Right. And so, yeah. 
Tell me about your grandpa. My grandpa is very nice. I love grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> right. Mm. How about your grandma? I love my grandma too. All right. I like my grandpa. Girl. So sweet. Hey, okay. <laughs> what can you tell me about your grandpa? Your grandma? Uh, I like him because he likes to play video games. And nice, and they make really good breakfasts, breakfasts and dinners. All right. Tell me about your mom and your dad. Oh my God! The health inspector doesn't like video games. My mom is a, an accountant, and she lets us play in our video games. And she video does let you play with your video games. No, we play in our video games. She lets us. Uh -huh. My dad says we didn't even play in our video games. I mean, we played more than our video games when we only played about ten minutes. And they're really nice. <laughs> And they like, we like cats, except for my dad. <laughs> uh, we like some, but... Where do you live? Uh, Bend, Oregon. Bend, Oregon. And how about you, Sophia? Where do you I live? I live in Aranda, California. No! Uh. Hey, you guys, have fun. I thought you were all hiking. Yeah. <laughs> Nadia's on her six-mile hike right now, isn't she? Seven. Look at all the oyster shells. God, that was a long I bought a little, my little. Yeah. Not barn, but so. shelter is right Yeah, they're kind of tucked in there. Yes. Yeah, and then they've been yeah. raising yeah. I don't need oysters. And there's a you can do a fire right there. It's all right to go. Yeah. Is that where you're going to have the bonfire right there? Somebody's sawing it right there. Oh, I thought this was going to have a bonfire. Yeah, of course. Of course. You've got to get the oils off. Snake alone. We can give the to Andrew for... Uh, Cook him up. For, yeah, for dinner. <laughs> Whoa, he's going toward me. Oh, he is. Snakes. <laughs> Snakes. <laughs> Snakes Another on the one. plane. So what are those there, John? These are Blue Point oysters. Uh, Luis just picked them up. They just pulled them out of uh, the ocean about 20 minutes ago. He didn't catch them himself, did he? Yes, he did. He did? Serious? Yes. yes. Where did he go to do it? I guess it was about 20 minutes away. Oh, and he went and just dug them out or whatever? Yeah. Wow. Took them off the rocks. Really? Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty great. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's all go down and go I, pull I some off the so. rocks. You like oysters? No. You don't? No. A little horseradish sauce on them. They're delicious. Sounds lovely. Yes. Maybe I'll have really one. Good. It might be good with horseradish. A little horseradish and... I'll try one. Cocktail sauce? I'll give it a try. Oh, they're delicious. Yeah. Um, we bought 20 dozen really? of the uh, oysters, yes. 20 dozen? 20 dozen. So there's like almost a dozen for everyone. Yeah, uh, half a dozen. Well, everyone. Andrew might want a few extra, so. Yeah, to go with his marshmallows. <laughs> Where you work? Excellent. Okay. So, so it's a little bit farther north, so like, uh, it's about eight blocks south of the south center. Okay. Cool. Yeah, you're, uh, uh, I'm not a I'm awesome. Everybody knows that. Is that Mr. Awesome right here? Yeah. So what game are you about to play? Don't pay attention to these weeds. I'm awesome. I'm a person. Ah. Oh, and he ate five marshmallows, three, two, three sodas, and he got sick. Okay, bye. What have you eaten so far today, Andrew? Oh, strawberry. Just one strawberry? And a watermelon. And a watermelon? How many marshmallows? Five. Five today? No. Oh, that was yesterday. Okay, that's good.
And uh, now, okay, now I want to hear again. What game are, were you about to play? Capture the flag. Don't capture the flag. Oh, oh and no, capture oh, exactly the flag. Happy Fourth of July. Oh, exactly. oh, oh, Happy Fourth of July, everyone. What What are the teams going to be? Fireworks go boom. <laughs> Girls versus boys. The teams are going to be girls versus boys. Because boys so rule. There looks like there's Everybody, more boys than girls here. Boys, this boys, oh, boys, okay. Boys, We've boys, got a few boys, more girls boys, coming boys, over boys, here. Boys. Yeah. Girls. Yeah. So I wish that girls are going yeah. to win. Whoa, yeah. nice. We're going to find nice. out. All right. Sweet. Do we need to do anything now? Uh, no, just leave it there. It'll cuck on its own. <laughs> Grandma! Oh, no. uh oh, what are the flags, guys? Um, you're not going to carry it. Court! Uh, Vince and I will do it. Okay. Hi. Hi there. What's your name? I walk. No, he doesn't. He doesn't rock. Oh, okay. No. So, so are you allowed, are you allowed to, like, right to that. are you allowed to, like, toss the flag okay. back? It's but it's that's on your side. Yeah, you so that thing is on, so that thing is, like, like, you can totally, like, the flag off and then like no throwing the flag though because no it's not gonna the work the jacket can hand like... it off though. Oh, also, Wait, are we telling you where the flags are or is it like no uh oh, sorry. Sorry. Right. no one's people on the ship as fun as that yeah let's uh like push the sticks to rest yes put the sticks to rest stop stop here we can use it as a guys bitcoin whoever wins nice I got that you back at least a foot and a half, two feet. I was almost scared firing this thing off. How many shots did you fire? Three. They're about three, bu three bucks a uh, you know, shell. How many people do you hit? <laughs> Four. Three. <laughs> I lined them up. I was lined I just put pack, 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 pack. <laughs> so. I teach him what you taught me. Careful, you're gonna drop him. Gone. Vince, grab him. Don't okay, want that. To be safe. Now, or to be safe. John, you take him down. That's gonna be a big problem. Could be. What is that? Hey. He protects Grandpa. Right John, John, white men can't jump. So you have no chance getting up there right now. <laughs> oh, he hit oh, me. Man. Did you see that? Dad, run, run, oh, yeah. Dad. <laughs> you, to, you better run. Yeah. Uh, all right, Jenny. I wouldn't. Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't you? Don't you all think it's appropriate to get John uh, a, a gift or something? I was thinking about getting him. A Dr. Schultz's um, a hair tonic. <laughs> <laughs> either either that or a, a beginner's cookbook. Yeah. That might be appropriate. Yeah. A child's cookbook. So, yeah. How to heat water. Just three different ways to heat water. <laughs>